Hello, hello, I'm Beth Joey and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, welcome. Welcome, this is the channel where I paint my face, turn my camera on and talk about some books. It is day 11 of the 12 days of Bookmas. Oh my God, we are almost at the end. Who can actually believe it? This has been so, so much fun, but also so incredibly hectic. I have had so much fun and I really, really hope that you have too. But yeah, let's jump straight into the 11th video in this series, which is going to be my big Christmas book haul. And these are all the books that I've acquired since my last book haul. These are for my birthday, these are for Christmas, Christmas. These are things I've bought myself. These are things that other people have bought me. And yeah, let's just jump straight in. There are like 20 something books on this list, by the way. So I'm not going to run through all of them in detail. If you can't know retail, I've had a cup of coffee, but no food. So I'm speaking really fast. I've got tons and tons of energy. I don't know if I'm making sense. Apologies if I'm not. Let's just get started. First up, we've got Snow Like Ashes, Ice Like Fire, and Frost Like Night by Sarah Rash. This is a series. I do not know anything about this series. It is just one that I got as part of a book swap on Depop. Then we've got One of Us is Lying, One of Us is Next, and Two Can Keep a Secret by Karen M. McManus. I think these two are part of a series and this is a separate one, but I'm not 100% sure. I haven't been able to figure this whole situation out just yet. Then we've got Good Girl Complex and Bad Girl Reputation by L. Kennedy. Got myself these at Waterstones because they just seemed like a bit of fun. Next up, we've got the second book in the Kingdom of the Wicked trilogy, I think it is, which is Kingdom of the Curse by Carrie Maniscalco. Love the first book, can't wait to get into the second. Then we've got The Ark of Well That Was Unexpected by Jesse Q. Sutanto. I got this at Yalk ages ago, but then forgot to really talk about it because it was posted to me after Yalk because I won it in a competition thing. So haven't read it yet. And by now the book has probably come out. Then we've got A Dark and Hollow Star by Ashley Shuttleworth. Then we've got The Light We Carry by Michelle Obama. My mum got this for me for my birthday. Thank you, mum. I haven't read any of Michelle Obama's books before, but hopefully after I read this, I love it and I want to pick up more. Then I got the Waterstones exclusive edition of Law Olympus by Rachel Smythe. I didn't even realize this had come out. I just stumbled on it in the YA section of Waterstones and immediately was like, I need this. Then I've got The Marriage Portrait by Maggie O'Farrell. This is a book that, again, my mum got me for my birthday. Thank you, mum. Then we've got Realm Breaker by Victoria Aviard. Then we've got These Twisted Bonds by Lexi Ryan. I haven't actually read uh, These Hollow Vows by the same author, which is the first book in this series, uh, but I got the special edition off of Fairy Loot because why not get the second book of a book that I haven't read yet? Then I bought myself The Wisteria Society of Lady Scoundrels by India Holton. Then my beautiful fiance, ooh, Ben, bought me The Twyford Code by Janice Hallett for my birthday. I also bought uh, Love in the Time of Serial Killers by Alicia Thompson for my birthday. I just love the sort of pop art nature of this cover and I just think the, by the blurb for it is just super quirky and fun. As you can tell, I went for a bit of a massive Waterstones haul with money I did not have, but I bought We Hunt the Flame by Hafsa Faisal. I I hope that's how you pronounce that. Apologies if not, I'll have to look that up later. But yeah, bought this one, start of a series, um, cause you know, my series goal just was not present in my mind when I bought this. I got Hex by Jenny Fagan. I read this and I absolutely loved it. Literally today, I bought myself True Crime Story by Joseph Knox. Another today purchase, which is why this annoying sticker is still on, is Verity by Colleen Hoover. Another today purchase from Waterstones was A Million Kisses in Your Lifetime by Monica Murphy. Then my beautiful fiance Ben <laughs> bought me Three Sisters by Heather Morris. This is the third book in the Tattooist of Auschwitz series. And lastly, I picked up Bloodmarked by Tracy Dion. And and I mean, this is the sequel to Legend Bond, which I loved. And I'm so, so keen to read this book. I think it's on my TBR for December. So I'm just gonna be, I'm just gonna be jumping right into this the minute I can. So those are 26 books that I bought recently or was gifted recently. Most of them, let's be honest, are things that I bought. And I am so, so excited to get stuck into every single one of them. Let me know what books you have bought recently, what you're reading at the moment. Come and chat to me in the comments down below. I love talking to you guys and I do my best to reply to every single comment. I really, really hope that you're enjoying this video and that you are enjoying the 12 days of bookmas if you are please do like subscribe and hit that notification bell all down below it is a super super easy way to help my channel grow and now is the right time to get involved because i have so much content that's come out in december and i've got a video coming out on christmas day as well and i'm super super excited for the new year and all the fun stuff that i'm going to be doing then so i will see you very very soon in a video coming out in two days time on christmas eve it will be books for my christmas wish list and giving the people i love very little time to get them but yeah, I hope to see you then. Bye.